Homes these days are equipped with all sorts of alarms and sensors. Smoke detectors beep us awake, lights flicker on when we enter a room, and smart thermostats throttle energy use. Could smart house plants be next? Indoor greenery already absorbs the carbon dioxide we exhale, it boosts oxygen levels, and brings a calming touch of nature. But some scientists say that house plants could do so much more. Using genetic engineering, they're creating smart plants that can sense invisible threats like mold, radon, and even viral pathogens. The method has already been tested in some crops. In one experiment, tobacco plants were genetically altered to signal when they encountered bacteria that cause a range of diseases. After exposing the tobacco to green light, leaves of plants with bacteria would glow orange, which could be observed with the aid of special goggles. Now, researchers want to take this strategy off the farm and into the household. Indoors, many common species of mold produce something called volatile organic compounds, chemicals that release into the air as the molds grow, affecting indoor air quality. But bioengineered houseplants could alert homeowners to such compounds by changing the colors of their leaves. As the plants filter the surrounding air, any traces would trigger a reaction, causing the leaves to change color and provide an easy to spot visual cue. This is just the start. Researchers believe plants could also be engineered to detect invisible threats, such as dangerous viruses, gases, and even radiation. Unfortunately, while we have a wealth of information on model plants like tobacco, we still have much to learn about the basic biology of many plants in our homes. When we finally have enough data for targeted engineering, scientists say that the homes of the future will have walls and air vents covered in smart leaves that can alert homeowners to a potential drop in air quality. In this lush version of the future, you won't exactly need a green thumb to turn your ficus into a fungus detector. Thank you